I'm Will. Porcus, Porcus. Will's a Dorcas. I know you are, but what am I? Oh my god, you got me good. <laughs> <laughs> Wasn't expecting that turn around. <laughs> and we're the Probits. Alright guys, welcome back. <laughs> I found something. It's important. It's important. Tonic, 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 tonic. Hey. Give it to the helper, I hey. think. Oh, okay. Yeah, drink this. Hey. Hey, hey. hey. <laughs> Yo. Drink it, drink it, drink it. Yo, your idiot won't. This shop tossing might be just what we need to break the curse and waken the prince. I'll try it at once. Splash it on the face. <laughs> That's all he needed. <laughs> he like, actually just terrifies him as he wakes up. <laughs> and, and, um. It's having a terrible nightmare. I'm still dreaming. Oh boy. I don't care. I dreamed I was in a coma. And. Yeah, yeah, there we go. Got the Mystic Key. That's what I wanted. I yeah, the Mystic Key! I forgot! You get it here! Awesome! Alright, we're going back to the Northern Keep. Uh, you brought a piece, something, blah, blah, blah. Oh, yeah. The Northern Keep has stuff with the Mystic Key. Back, um, back in the cave has stuff with the Mystic Key. I say, the I enemies, think the Dwarf's Caves has a Mystic Key. The enemies key. haven't gotten any stronger. Oh, yeah, the Marsh Cave has Mystic Key stuff, too. Dang it, there's a lot with the Mystic Key. At least you get it now and not later in the game, because that would really stink as far as backtracking. We were pro we were thinking about... Uh, I, I don't was... remember if we did this in an episode or not, but it was like... We were talking about how Square Enix was going out of business when they made this game, right? Oh, yeah, no, we were talking about this on either at Arby's or on the way to Arby's, but... Um... And it was just like, well, I want a game... It's Square Enix thought it was their last hurrah, so they said... Well, for our last game, why don't we just make a game we'd all enjoy playing? Yep. I feel like that's what they did. They were just like, okay. Literally, the only reason this game is called Final Fantasy is because they thought it was their last game they were ever going to make because they were dying. And they were like, let's for, just... Uh, this is the Final Fantasy. For reference, Fantasy. see King's Knight and or 3D World Run. <laughs> yeah. Uh, yep. Uh, did we mention it there? Uh, well, it was on the car right over to your house, I think. And it was just like... Yeah. So, um, King's Knight was one of their one of their games that's just so bad. Artificially increasing difficulty from something arbitrary, like it wanted to be a collectathon without real collectibles or any really? rewarding system. Your reward was being able to beat the game. Huh. You know, hardly a fitting reward. Yeah, definitely. <laughs> I, I just, you know. Mm hmm I don't know. Sorry, you can't see my face, but right, yeah, it'd just be the, the expression of just the kind of uh, yeah. yeah, arms to the side, like what, what, are, what are you well, doing? Well, what do you expect? What are you, what are you doing, Square Enix? Yeah, and they didn't, they didn't expect Final Fantasy to go that well. They just kind of made a fun little RPG. They're like, yeah, this is revolutionary, but we don't expect this to save us. We just kind of expect this to be our last hurrah. Well, it's like, you, you remember how those tabletop RPGs from the West work. Yeah. You have like these cool stories and stuff, but why don't we just write a story and put in gameplay elements from those RPGs we Just liked? make it a game, and frickin... It worked. It worked. And it, it worked a little too well. Excellent job, yeah, and now there's 27 different... 14 different Final Fantasies. 15. And, yeah, I would say... 15 and... Does World of Final Fantasy even count? I meant like main entry just, just flagship main entry titles. Entry I wasn't even talking about number. spin offs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. We, we haven't even delved into Kingdom Hearts yet. Oh, Jesus. Yeah. <laughs> Disney and. Disney and Final Fantasy had a baby. And Basically. they named it Kingdom Hearts. And then oh, they had no. 12 games. Caleb. Stop. <laughs> just. I don't want to hear about your gas. <laughs> I don't want to no, hear I, about I blew a gasket. They are. <laughs> My car. That's just. That's just. Head gasket. That's just forced. That's just bad. That's just a bad time. <laughs> if you no say sand. this pun, you're gonna have a bad time. Stop. There, we can't have sands entering this. Video. I'm not doing sands. That's actually South Park reference. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it's a ski instructor. <laughs> oh yeah. That's the reference I was trying to make the other day when we were playing Mario Party. And every time, you know, Josh, Josh was like, bah, 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 bah. I was like, Undertale didn't invent bad time. But yeah, I agree. I think of. Undertale 2, but I've been watching South Park recently. <laughs> and they did it first. Yep. If you go down this hill and you're not doing your 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 pizza... You're gonna have a bad time. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> pizza, it was pizza or fries? Yeah, pizza or fries, that's it. That's a really good way to explain skiing to young kids, though. That's, I mean, easy for me to even understand. Pizza, uh, you go slow. Fries, you go fast. Any gonna, questions? Yeah, it's gonna be the next floor and it's gonna be all the rooms on the bottom. 
That's what I was thinking. I just want to see what's in here. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, this is. You guys are coming with us for this nice little journey. Into yeah, the, this is just a. It's a side side thing. Us getting whatever. Well, I think something's gonna have something important. I just don't freaking remember what or where. Oh, what's this? Yay! That was. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh no! It's being guarded. Pisca demons. Pis so what are they like? Piscopalians. What? They had to like pee really bad or something. Pisca yeah. Yes, William. They they work at a corporation about peeing. They're demons that work for Pisco. <laughs> 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 That's what they are, William. <laughs> uh, thank you for clarifying. Yeah, like that joke I set up. <laughs> they work at a corporation for peeing. They work at Pisco. <laughs> It's like Costco, but for pee. Yeah, but like, you know, just peeing is the only thing they sell. Oh, antidote. Oh, antidote! <laughs> I went through that for an antidote? Yeah, well, there's there's other ones There's other ones to your left and right, I know, so. I gotta go. Oh, no! Oh, no! Spiders! Oh, this isn't enough for antidote. Yep. <laughs> We're out of here. <laughs> See ya, fella. Yep. <laughs> Where the red mage fails, the thief will yeah. succeed. Oh, this looks important. Uh-oh. More Pisco demons. <laughs> Please buy a pair <laughs> uh, I... You want samples? You want samples? You want samples, yeah? Um... It's just is, like, is a bad word? Uh, it's just another word for P. That's right? It's not like I'm saying the S word, which has a lot deeper of a connotation. It doesn't really. It's just another word, but... Words don't hurt. So Everyone pees! Why would this be a bad Silver word? Silver armlet. No, it's not Ooh. an important item. It's just a really good one. Holy crap, that's awesome. Uh, yeah, most of most of the Mystic Key stuff is not going to be stuff you need. But it's going to be stuff you want. <laughs> I'll um, take it. Yeah, definitely. Um, but freaking, here, the only reason I mentioned that is because I don't necessarily say, you know, that word. I don't necessarily say piss when I have to go to the bathroom. I say I have to we pee. We all the time in the Navy. Really? Yeah. That's funny. But the point is, is that my mom asks if we need to tee tee. If we need a tinkle. She says words like that. So for a while, she used to say that all the time. And to combat that, I would say, no, but I need to piss. And she did not like that. Needless to say, she wasn't, uh, a, she wasn't a huge fan of my flipping that around on her and um you were but you were also being a rebellious teenager i honestly wasn't <laughs> i was 20. <laughs> uh, spoiler alert this happened a lot more recent than you probably think it did it's only three years ago yeah uh like i mean like probably closer to two years ago but yeah um the last room is going to be in the bottom right hand corner. But, um, yeah. <laughs> I didn't mean to throw you off by that one. Yeah. I was not prepared. Well, the thing is, I I didn't have a rebellious teen phase. And because I had of a that, rebellious adult phase. <laughs> <laughs> I'm experiencing my midlife crisis a little early. But, like, it's, it's a thing of, um, I didn't, I was a goody goody two shoes nice kid growing up. And in a lot of ways, you know, I still have some of those aspects, but because of that, my mom has come to the terms that, like, even though I got blamed for a lot of things when I was a kid, she realized later that usually it was Becca or Matthew, my siblings, blaming me, and usually I actually didn't do the things. I'm not perfect. I did plenty of bad things. But not as many as they thought. Yeah, and I honestly, most of the time I didn't mean to do the bad things. I just, you know, well, kind you, of was hyper. People, people mess up. That's yeah, 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 life. and mistakes. Live and learn. But exactly. no, the um, the I only, I only, real quick. I just the only reason I say that is to say that because I was goody goody two shoes, nice growing up, and because you know I was the sweet kid. I I'm now at a point where I can be super sassy and sarcastic with my mother and she like she laughs at it she thinks it's hilarious because it's not like me so because of that honestly I'm more often sarcastic to her than I am nice nowadays but she thinks it's the funniest thing because in her mind you know that's not how I well, am well maybe maybe she realizes hey, like, because down, you down. have to I already got that one Oh, uh, what? You got uh, the one Oh, wolves. Oh, boy. <laughs> wolf, wolf, wolf. <laughs> Lots of them. Yeah. All right, we are AOEing. Uh, you got the one in the middle. I don't think you got the one in the far right. Uh, did I? I don't, we'll, we'll I'm see not in sure. A minute. We're about to see. 
Well, let me kill these wolves first. That's a lot of experience just kind of sitting around, and I kind of want it. <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Oh jeez. I freaking so first of all, I've always been a fan of the three Suges growing up, even though they were like way before our time. Second of all, I love when characters from shows reference the Stooges. Um you didn't watch The Simpsons, correct? Or did you? Um, uh, oh boy. Did you ever see any of the Simpsons or part of the Simpsons or You're in samples? You missed. They showed up again, Caleb. I'm yeah, sorry. Yeah, I'm I sorry. couldn't resist. Yeah, I was like, oh, was that a scene from Simpsons? I don't remember that. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I remember Butt Scratchers. Yeah, that's that was from, from Family, Family Guy. Guy. Yep. But the point is that before I went on my South Park bender that I'm currently on, I was going on a Simpsons <laughs> bender. And I reached a point where I'm like, all right, I don't need to watch anymore because it's starting to visibly decline. I haven't reached that part in South Park yet, and I uh, honestly it, don't it think I will. It. Yeah, that no one's reached that part uh, in South that's Park. That's a lot of guilt. Yeah, dang. See, that's cool. Um, the I say that to say next time. Next time, <laughs> we'll figure this. All out. I was saying is that in Simpsons, uh, there's been some scenes where like Bart, for one, Bart likes to talk like a Cockney like British kid sometimes, and it's so funny because his parents keep telling him not to, but it's just this weird thing for like a ten year old boy to do. And then also, he he pretends to be like Curly from the Three Stooges a lot, and it's so funny because nice it's guy, eh? it shouldn't like he he's so like it's so out of his era and he's so young that like he shouldn't be doing these things. So to see him do it, he's like <laughs> like wiping his face, you know, it's like oh wise guy, eh? you know, like doing the voice and stuff. It's just <laughs> so funny to watch. Anyway. Next on Robots, we'll uh, uh, we'll discuss probably more stooge students. Yeah, we might actually be in a different area, but uh, probably not. <laughs> I really love the animations. Nice. Game. That's pretty nice. It's just like Final Fantasy Four. Bye, guys. Huh? Oh yeah, bye. <laughs> Sorry, I was watching the game. Yeah, I was um, I was, <laughs> I was watching you.